Hello, Leo, getting ready to do your reading. Okay. I like to look back and just see what the last readings were. Sometimes they're the same person. Other times it's, it's for a different group of people, but I was just looking at them and what I named them. And it's, you had one where the person was reckless and could, their passion could lead to a reckless decision. I think it was, yeah, behavior. And then spying and wondering if you're still mad. Who is this person you're dealing with, Leo? They, um, uh, I don't know. All right, so let's see what's coming up for you. If it's the same person, what's going on with that situation or if there's a new situation coming in. So your person seems a little out of control or something. I'm gonna put it this way. Okay, let's see the King of Wands, he's in reverse. Okay, what, what is this? Oh, the Seven of Cups. Someone may be feeling really overwhelmed. Some, okay, someone might be in a marriage right now. This could be you, this could be somebody else, but um. This can be options. Sometimes when people go online and they want to date online, you know how you have options? Seven of Coins tells me someone might be online dating. Someone who's married might be online dating. It doesn't have to be you. I'm not talking about you. I'm just talking about a general message. Um, I don't know. That might resonate with someone. If you're dating possibly a fire sign or you met a fire sign online and you are wondering if they are married, I think they are. That was a specific message for somebody here, okay? So, and you, and the thing is, I think you know they are. Okay. What is the overall energy for this reading? What is the overall energy for this reading? Somebody is really sad. Okay. How this person is, oh yeah, someone's in their emotions quite deep. How they view you. Oh, the world. So kind of like an ending. I mean, it can be a new beginning. Action advice need to know is the three of wands. It's in reverse. So someone may be losing hope about a situation, feeling like there's no new chance or new beginning. And the outcome is the Five of Swords, interesting. Under the deck is the Six of Coins in reverse. The only thing I'm thinking right now is possibly someone's letting go. Someone doesn't want to be breadcrumbed anymore or they're not getting, giving at all. I think I'll use this one to clarify. Okay, so overall energy is the Five of Cups. Someone is feeling very sad and disappointed at this time. So we have, yeah, Hermit, wow, Eight of Cups. Oh, I pulled two, I was gonna go pull one more. Listen to your intuition, Empress. Okay, this could be you cutting somebody off. You may be coming in as Empress and maybe you've just had it with the situation. Uh, maybe you feel like this person isn't treating you well. Maybe you told them that. Maybe you're not talking to them. Someone could have gotten ghosted in this situation. Maybe someone's pregnant though and not happy about it, but I'm not sure. But okay, what is the moon energy? What is the moon? The Three of Coins, the Seven of Wands, and then the King of Wands. There's some drama here with this person now. There could be three people, Three of Coins. Doesn't have to be, but again, what is this King of Wands doing? Oh, there's a Queen of Coin in reverse. Four Swords not taking action. Okay, some of you, there could be um, a wife or husband in the mix here and there's going to be a period here of no communication that may have already happened but it's kind of like okay this is what i'm feeling i feel like this king of wands is the person you're dating i don't think that's you but i feel like this person is kind of like a deer in headlights is what i'm feeling this person is sitting there like they're stunned i don't know why why is this person stunned i'm not sure um there's this you may have been blocked recently by someone the Queen of Coin, though, in reverse, usually is someone who's very controlling, very like they're there for the money only. They're very focused on themselves. Um, they're not really worried about anyone else in the picture. So I kind of feel like this Queen of Coin is very controlling. They're controlling every aspect of this person's life. They're texting, they're, they're you know, male. Um, they may work together possibly. I don't really think so, but the Three of Coins kind of Seven of Wands kind of makes me feel like that um now they see you as the world ten of cups the four of wands and the three of wands see messages under here they were hoping three of wands upright this usually means somebody is married and then this is getting into a new relationship but now they're seeing like that window closing is what i'm getting so they had hope that this was going to work out they see you as an empress but it it appears like they're walking away or you walked away. This person right now is not going to take action because, again, I think they're being like scrutinized. Um, there's a lot going on behind the scenes. They may be getting audited also. 
need to know the three of wands that something is not on the horizon right now. It doesn't mean it's not going to come in, but five of wands, this person, oh my gosh, is this person in a relationship where all they do is fight and they can't get out of it? Now, it seemed like this came up in your reading. I think that was two readings ago where this person wanted to be very reckless and they wanted just to get the hell out of Dodge and get away from this relationship or something and they can't right now. So I'm giving you a delay reading is what I'm telling you right now, unfortunately. But this person is very sad and heartbroken. They think that you have walked away for good. They know you deserve better, Leo. They know it. And they, they just can't give it to you right now because they're dealing with another situation. It could have to do with money or taxes or something is what I'm getting. I'm doing more two of swords, not wanting to see. They're out in the cold. Oh my gosh. So maybe this person may be having some major financial issues. Maybe they got drained by this person or are they just having, you know, debt problems. They could be losing their business. It could be related to COVID. Not wanting to see they're out in the cold. So they may be embarrassed. They may be ashamed. It doesn't have to be about money. It could be other things. They view you as the empress, but they know that they can't give you what you want. Now, I'm not saying you even want this stuff from them. They're just showing that they actually do they do value you they put you on a pedestal leo they think you are you know man or woman very attractive and you deserve more you deserve better but they can't provide it so there's a delay here what is the five of swords though why is that the outcome i'm wondering if this is like the queen of coins energy blocking it the world the knight of swords oh, I pulled. no they're gonna make a break for it so, like I said, the three of wands in reverse, it doesn't mean it's not coming in. It just means there is a delay. But the five of swords could be a timeline. So it could be roughly five, probably not five days. It may be more like five weeks, unfortunately. But there will be messages. So there's a new cycle starting with this connection. There is somebody coming in very quickly with communication. Let me clarify that, though. Because we see there's no action here, the four swords. And again, this, this section is the need to know. This is kind of peek behind the scenes. So this actually may not be a huge delay. It's just showing us how this person is feeling defeated. Like they can't give you what you want. What is the Knight of Cups? What is the Knight of Cups for Leo? What is the Knight of Cups for Leo? The Nine of Coins, the Four of Cups, the Three of Cups, the Wheel of Fortune, and the Death card. Okay, so... You know what I'm getting? I'm getting someone doesn't want the settlement. Someone doesn't want the divorce settlement. Or somebody is in court right now. I'm getting somebody doesn't want what's been given to them. Like the Queen of Coins may not like the settlement, the Four of Cups. She's not happy with it. Sorry. I feel like there's a lot of gossip or girlfriends or people in this group. But again, oh, wait a minute. Because something's going on behind the scenes money. This person may be trying to get a divorce. It's definitely what I'm seeing here. But also, though, this could be the, she thinks you're gone. Death to the third party, right? That was initially what I thought. But I thought, I don't see how that's with the Knight of Cups. So somehow this person is going to get around this. This person has told their partner that you're not in the picture anymore. Or they think that. Maybe this person's been very upset, maybe even crying. And they've seen how emotional and how hurt they are. And so it makes them feel like they won the Five of Swords. Someone has said, this person has said that they don't want your cup, Leo, but they were lying. So someone thinks there's, there's an ending here to this third party. I can read this several different ways. Because I still see the Four of Cups here. Maybe they said you didn't want their cup or something like that. Because you're in, well, I think you did though, Leo. Have you told them, I don't want your cup, you're in, we're in a third party, I don't want this anymore? Okay, let me, let me the spouse keep coming in. One more for the Knight of Cups, please. One more for the Knight of Cups. Death. Judgment, but Page of Wands. Okay, Page of, I get communication, you guys, but it's, it's definitely, now death is here. It's being delayed, like I initially said. It will be delayed. And I hate to tell you that, because I know that sucks, but... It could be um, an earth sign you're talking to. What is it? One more of the page of wands, page of coin. 
Yeah, it could be a king of coin. Okay, what, what would this person like to say to you? Just being near you is intoxicating. You are the best thing in my life. I wonder if you're happy without me. What else is going on here? We have Cupid's arrow. So have faith, love is coming. Surprise, invitation, meeting or hesitation. The dragonfly, be lighthearted, finding out things coming to light. And the palm tree, stability, security, permanence, growth, endurance, and flexibility. Interesting. So it's interesting because now they're coming in as a king of coins. It almost felt like this person may contact you about finances or money or something, or they have a lawyer, or they might have someone else contact you, or they might talk to you about, page of coin can be like about money or things like that, the everyday things. I don't know if that, rep, if that resonates with anyone. Why would they talk to you about money? Some of you may work for this person. Some of you may be in accounting or something like that also is what I'm getting. They may talk to you about business or work. Maybe that's how you knew them. Because that means something here. I can tell for someone significant that they're coming in as the king of coin now with the page of coin, the communication that's coming into you. Okay. Palm tree's been coming up a lot for different signs. Um, let me do one more from that deck. What is the palm tree? What's coming then? Okay, separation. Yeah, and one more. Sunglasses watching. Okay. Because I think what's happening here is things are coming to light to this person's spouse or something like that. This spouse wants more security. King and queen of coin usually are a married couple. And that's what I'm seeing here. Like there's some background things going on with money, huge, that you don't know about that's causing delays and issues. This person maybe, uh, what's it called, being taken to the cleaners or something. Um, I just feel like they, get, well, this is actually the one I should probably show you, right? There's something else going on in this reading behind the scenes that you don't know about and, or you do now, but you might know some of this. But anyways, um, so I think it's you in separate. I don't think the palm tree is you. I mean, it could be down the way. I don't feel like it's you. And I feel like I have to tell you that so you're not, you know, expecting this right away. Um, I don't know if the person also is a lawyer or, um, I was going to say doctor. I didn't mean doctor, accountant or something like that also. But separation would be the two of you in sunglasses. This person is spying on you and watching you a lot. This makes more sense. I felt like I just needed more. That didn't make sense to me. Because, yes, there's love here. But I think the finding out could be you finding out about um the money issues, but also, I also feel like there could be some hidden money in this reading or something. Someone's trying to get more money. This might be, yeah, this, this may also go back to that reading where they were, they wanted to do reckless behavior, like I said, and the universe was like, slow down. That wasn't a good idea. They could lose everything, but, um, I don't know. I don't know what's going on now. There could be some negotiations. I'm going to ask for advice. Let me go to a different deck, though. Let me go to a, a, a new deck I haven't used yet for this reading. Please give us advice for Leo, what Leo needs to know. What does Leo need to know about this relationship and what's going on? Six of Wands, Victory, the Queen of Swords is fine. The King of Cups is here. The Six of Coins. And the... Okay. Be careful because the sunglasses could actually be the other person is spying on you, the spouse. It may be them. Um, again, this person feels like they have victory for now. Again, this is a very specific reading. So I know if you're with me here, it resonates. This won't resonate for a lot of people, but this person is the one spying. The King of Cups is the one who feels very heartbroken, but is giving money out. And I feel like they're giving a lot of money. So they could be paying lawyers if they are getting a divorce, but they could just be paying this, uh, this other person off. And of course, this could be a man. It doesn't have to be a man and a woman. It could be, you know, you guys all get it. it could be um, a woman having to pay the man. But wanting to hold on to the money to be victorious and wanting to end things. Yeah. What's interesting is this person, this death has come up quite a bit. This person is trying to get rid of this other situation. But they are actually having to take their time. I think it is to create more stability in their life so they can come to you with a better, I don't want to say proposition, but to have more to offer you. See that? He wants to hang on to his money. He's tired of giving it away to her. and But he wants to be victorious and end the situation. So that is probably what they're doing right now. They could be in court right now fighting. 
this person may be trying to invest money, yeah, maybe starting investments, starting over, but they seem to have some money here. They could have some money hidden. You are under the deck, Leo, seeing things differently. They're in a very toxic, maybe codependent relationship. You can definitely see that with a lot of fighting. So, and they are heartbroken right now. They wanna walk away. So for some of you, you need to know all this because I have a feeling you're, you're not hearing from them. You're wondering what's going on. Yes, there are more delays. They're trying to get out of the situation. It is difficult, but um, what else does Leo need to know? Confident, someone is very confident. Confident about the situation or that'll end. We have someone with some past hurt and a caretaker. That can mean so many things. Sometimes codependent relationships, one person is a caretaker to the other and one person is, again, maybe bringing it past hurts or injured or something like that to try to keep the person to stay. But, okay, anything else, universe? Let me just grab one romance card just to see what their advice on the situation is for Leo. Okay, it's safe for you to love. Open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. All right, so I'm going to leave it there. I hope this was helpful. Have a really great week, you guys, and I'll talk to you soon.